a little R2-D2-ish. Your mom's a little R2-D2-ish. Not too sure I like that. Welcome back to our stupid reaction TV. It's I'm Corbin. I'm disturbed. And you can follow us on Instagram and Twitch on all juicy content. So juicy. And uh, thank you for some Patreon. Follow us on official Twitter account. <laughs> and follow us on official 2.0 channel if you like American reaction. <laughs> Today we are reacting to Paraka. <laughs> Corbin is Paraka. Paraka. That sounds like some kind of a throwaway exclamation. How would you pronounce that? Pataka. Ah. Oh. Well, it's directed by Vishal Bardalash. I... Bring it. <laughs> Say no more. Say no more. So uh, what is this? Is this, is this is a new no, Vishal film? No, 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 no. I think it came out in 2018. Well, it's new for us because we haven't seen this. Yes. But I still like the idea of you like saying some exclamation in Hindi that, that means something where you would be upset and like disturbed with your Newborn son who's coming. Pataka! 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 I already told you! Pataka! <laughs> no problem. Watch. Yeah, we're ruining it. It's probably something really deeply meaningful. <laughs> like... We ruin everything. Here we go. <laughs> How'd you know there was whistling? I didn't. Wow. <laughs> दोनों बिल्ले ऐसी थीं जैसे कि भारत पाकिस्तान एक माँ की औलाद पर एक दूसरे के खून की प्यासी भारत की मम्मी बीड़ी ढूंढे हैं बात खड़ी की शर्म नहीं आए तो है मेरी बड़ी बहन तो मुझसे बात मेरी जुत्ती बात करेगी तो से चोटनी कुतिया नमस्ते My English teacher from Indian Army is Lu. Hello? Hello. Charlak ki goos. Ek san Charlak kaan te hao hai. Bapu, badke ke chutke. Arbaz. Kaya ko? Mrs. Patel. अंग्रेजी बात में सुधार लीजो अब भी भाग अटल बिहारी वाजपेयी जी ने परवेज मुशर्रफ जी से सौ टके की बात कही थी आगरा में हम अपने दुश्मन तो चुन सकते हैं पर पड़ोसी नहीं रिश्ते तो चुन सकते हैं पर रिश्तेदार नहीं Did I 
say it right? Good grief. But that kind of... I don't know, I'm just confused. Why? Well, at first I thought I knew what it was about, and then I didn't know what it was about, and then it was weird, and then I know I wasn't getting cultural references, and it's Vishal, so that's a huge bonus for me, as well as the dad from Gully Boy, mm -hmm. but... Uh, uh, BJ Ross. Yeah, exactly. On a, but on a whole, I don't know yet if I want to see it. It just struck me as like... Really? I thought, yeah. it, I thought it looked really good. I yeah? what, what was confusing about it? I just didn't understand if it was supposed to be a straight comedy or a quirky comedy or... Um, I think like most of his stuff, it's like almost going to be a, that's a what dark comedy. I assumed that that's what was confusing me because I would expect from Vishal it would be a dark comedy. But I didn't, it didn't feel like a dark comedy. I, I think it's going to be more of a coming of age story with some comedy. Okay. But between two sisters. It's, 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 I think it's a sister story. 100%. I got that. Yeah. Yeah. I think it's about two sisters. Um... Based on Charan Singh Patek's short story, Dubanan, I think that's it. Banane. Dubanane. Pataka narrates the story of two feuding sisters who realize the true ma nature of their relationship only after marriage separates them. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I got, I got the kind of coming of age story of two sisters. Yeah. I didn't get, um, basically, if this was going to be dark, quirky, straight in the comedic realm, or all three. Probably all three. Um, and whether or not I like it. Because it's Vishal Bardwaj, I will watch it. Period. Uh, but as far as the trailer goes, it just, I, it, I didn't know what to do with it. I was like, what is this? What is this going to be? Oh, well, I didn't get that at all. I thought it looked really good. <laughs> cool. <laughs> I understood it the whole time. I don't, I don't know what you think. You understood? You under yeah. I, no, no, no. You understood the genre as far as it was straightforward for you? Yeah. Really? Yeah, it was almost... So you think it's it a dark almost, comedy? No, like, not like dark comedy like in um, uh, Seven Coup Moth. That's what I'm... No, because that's not what it gave me. It gave me right. almost Vishal Bardwash makes a sister queen movie. But not as lighthearted as Queen. Okay, that's what I was getting from it. Okay, so it's a the feuding, like like I said, feuding sisters. But then they go their separate ways. But then they end up finding they they really need each other and love yeah. each other. And I, plot this, I got. So, it was the it was the it was the kind of comedic. Well, I think that's why you have to go see the film <laughs> to understand it, Vic. <laughs> I know, but also, a, lot, did we know a lot of trailers are straightforward with genre mixing. That, that's the only thing I was confused by, was what kind of comedy and will it be a blend of those comedies? Well, I think um, every single Vishal film that we've seen is a blend. Sem Kun Moth is dark comedy, period. Well, yeah, it's a, it's a, it doesn't have vaudevillian comedy in it. This looks like it could have vaudevillian comedy, it looks like it could have highbrow comedy, dry comedy, dark comedy. It had all of that in the trailer. Okay. But... And, so that's where I'm trying to, and is that the point? Is he going to just do all forms of comedy? So that's where I was confused. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I, I didn't get that. I don't want to have an argument. No, about and that's it. fine. I, that you didn't. That's I, just for me where my consternation I, I, lies. I, I, I kind of understood what he was going for in the trailer. It's just genre wise, I, you know what kind of comedy it's going to be. I, I, I know it's going to be a Vishal Bardwash film, which usually has a blend of a bunch. That's what I, I, I expect from him. What other Vishal film have we seen besides Seven Kun Moth that's comedic? Heather has a lot of comedic moments in it. So you would you describe Heather as a comedy? No. Yeah. So what other comedies? Genres. We... It, 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 I don't even think this is a major comedy. <laughs> I think this is a story, a coming of age story that has some comedy. What's so confusing about that? <laughs> You're doing one of these things that you do occasionally in our reactions that's so annoying. <laughs> what? I express my consternation? No, you, you for some reason can't understand a basic concept. It's not the concept that's confusing oh me. It's this is why genre. I want to talk about it because you're it's an the idiot. I, we, Vishal, compo you keep, Vishal composed it again. I think he composed it Which doesn't all surprise me. Stuff. 
Uh, I'm done talking about that, so That's we can great. talk about a different great. aspect of it. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Let's not talk about concept and genre, because oh. clearly that's not a happy thing. Yeah, so it has VJ Roz, uh, who I absolutely love. And, and our first and first would, introduction to was in Gully Boy, which was great. I would love to see more of his stuff, so that's a huge draw for me in this, even though he looks like the father. When did this come out? Uh, last year, 2018. Um, okay, so here's a question. Everybody knows how much we love Vishal Bardwaj. Mm -hmm. I don't recall this being in the recommendations at the top of the list for his films. Do you? As far as a stupid baby saying you need to watch fill in the blank. No, but we've seen a lot of his other stuff that is like uh, coming. Right, right, right. Shit. We've so, seen the main stuff yeah, of his so, so far. Other than obviously, we still have to see Umkara. Yeah, so they're obviously going to have to tell us if this is yeah worth is it, worth it, how to do. Uh, and the, these but, young ladies, have we seen them before? I thought we saw one of them in uh, Chokta, honestly, but I could be totally and utterly wrong. Um, Watch, one of them was in Dongle. We're gonna like probably. <laughs> that's probably what it is. <laughs> uh, these are probably the two sisters, right? Yeah, Dongle. Dongle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the first one. Oh uh, man, one of them wasn't Dongle. <laughs> that's probably that's probably where we know her from. Because I recognize her from something. Not anything I, too. I couldn't. I but couldn't. I couldn't. It wasn't like, hey, it's the girl from Dongle. Oh I well, figure it out. We've got. Uh, that was a while ago. I mean, that, how long ago was Dongle? Eight, twenty, thirty-seven years ago. Probably five months ago. That was yeah. one of the actually first outside of. I think we watched that after we watched like PK and. It, yeah, we uh, did. Uh, it was three we, we saw we saw three idiots. We saw PK, and then Dongle was our third Amir Khan film because we reacted to his transformation video first. Yeah, and then we watched Dongle. So it's been a while since we've seen those young ladies. I would love to talk to uh, VJ Raz. Oh yeah, like like I I know he's not like this huge star. Uh, obviously in India, he's just, I think he's like an actor's actor. Yeah. He reminds me of like Paul Bettany. Yeah, exactly. Uh, he's one of those guys that every actor in India you knows know, and respects. People, people know Paul Bettany now because he's in Avengers, of course. But before, yeah, but before, before that. Avengers, yeah. now, he wasn't a household name. He's no. still probably not a household name. No. But like he is an amazing actor that the industry loves and will always put him in. Another person like that, though he has had some leading roles, he does not, he's not a household name as John C. Riley. Oh yeah, yeah John who all actors love John C. Riley, and he was he had such a weird career because like for a while like people that didn't know him in the industry thought he was just a funny guy because he was right. in Will Ferrell comedies, right? But he is like a thespian, a legit actor. Like a he's legit a he started actor. the dramatic, but yeah. he could be hilarious. Yeah, like he's what he's actually probably one of the best, best actors, actors in Hollywood. One hundred percent. He's one of the few that could do both. He can do everything seamlessly. He's, yeah, he's really and that's how I get the feeling of him the same way. Well, I loved him in Delhi. Belly. So yeah, the fact so good the fact Belly. that this is Vishal, I'm in. I mean, Vishal, anything that he makes, I will see. Vijay Raz and uh, a bunch of stuff like yeah. that. So let us know how it is in the comment section below. And what other Vishal? Because like like we said, anything, anything with him. Yep, anything he's involved in. And you know I'm we like him sure, a little bit. <laughs> and, and I'm pretty sure every film he's ever done, he does the score for. So I would see it that for that as well, because his scores are always he started great. as a composer. Yeah, he, he's, he's a pretty talented man. <laughs> <laughs>